At Sea Lord, we take sustainability seriously. Our Japanese and our Maori shareholders are intergenerational investors, and we recognise the importance of ensuring that what we give to our grandchildren is in better condition than we inherited from our parents. New Zealand has a very large economic zone. It's about the fourth biggest in the world. Less than 9% has ever been trawled, and the areas we trawl are generally year on year the same areas. Well, in New Zealand, we've got 90% of our economic zone never been touched by bottom trawls. A bottom trawling catches about one third of the total fish catch in the world each year. We're able to accurately deploy our nets where we want them to be. We will ensure that there are fish out into the future. We're taking all the conservative options. New Zealand fish that's caught is caught under the quota management system. We're moving more and more of our fisheries into certification, which gives consumers a guarantee that they should purchase that fish. Silo tuna comes from stocks where the fish numbers are healthy. Um, we always buy from legal operators. The fish is always caught in a way that's dolphin safe. Sea Lord's new range of New Zealand line caught albacore tuna has actually been certified by the Marine Stewardship Council. Um, that means it's certified as sustainable and they're the largest organisation in the world. Looking after the sea is essential. We do this by making sure our fish stocks are healthy. We work with the sea and we want to make sure that we fish it in a sustainable way. We deal with a limited resource and we have to protect it for today and tomorrow for our children and also the wider community. Sea Lord and the people that work within the company have a passion for the marine environment and sustainability is one of our core values.